new apprentice is standing in front of you, a bit insecure and lost in the new environment. But also for you, a new story is starting and probably you too have a lump in your throat. You are the mentor and of course you want to help your apprentice feel comfortable and accepted in your company. But how can you get the apprentice involved in the work processes and your business culture as quickly and as successfully as possible besides all your regular work? Don't worry. In these videos, we will thoroughly explain you how to do so in these three steps. Facilitate first steps at the workplace, assign tasks related to the learning outcomes following the problem-based learning methodology, guide the apprentice on the personal and social evolution, providing solutions that improve the mentorship. So you have a new apprentice whose heart rate is slightly increased. If you're lucky, your apprentice wants to prove him or herself while not being quite sure how to do so. Once you have as a mentor gained apprentice's trust and helped him or her to gain self-confidence to be able to perform well, involve your apprentice even more into your team and introduce new colleagues. This way, the apprentice will become familiar with both the company culture and company's production or services. This will increase your apprentice's loyalty and sense of belonging that will consequently have a positive influence on the promotion and reputation of your company. Familiarize the apprentice with the workflow, introduce tasks that your apprentice will need to carry out in the company, if necessary, step by step. Allow the apprentice to observe you and learn from you. Offer support, answer any questions that might arise, and help the apprentice to prioritize tasks. In this initial phase, frequently repeat warnings of potential risks. Remind your apprentice of obligations before the deadlines get too tight. This way, you will help overcome the fear of the unknown in the introductory phase and give your apprentice the opportunity to prove its own abilities in the long run. Don't rush. Now it is crucial to establish a safe environment and trust between you and your apprentice as only this kind of a relationship will lead to successful results for both of you. Additionally, make sure that your apprentice has had enough time to understand your instructions accurately. This way, you prevent too many mistakes and stress later on.